My name is Adil Gerza and I am sitting with Anika Finke Banyard from Kaya Moya. It's an amazing foundation and she's here to tell us a little bit more about it. It's actually called Kaya Moya Art Connects and it aims to connect children with wildlife through the medium art. I founded that trust a year ago. I'm a wildlife artist myself, very much involved in wildlife conservation my whole life. The art is a medium to go through the heart, create a soft spot in them actually for later a warming up the heart for being tuned to wildlife conservation. So having a personal connection to it, that's why it's called Kaya Moya Art Connects. Is it safe to assume these are your creations? Only half of it. What is the purpose of the exhibition? It's basically about raising awareness for wildlife, it's raising awareness for wildlife art, and it's also um, to raise funds for our work because the Kaimo Art Connects Trust creates opportunity for children. So we have to take them out of the city, we have to take them out of Katutura, we drive with them to everywhere we can see wildlife, but this is costing money so we need funds for that. In the beginning I started it with like just selling certain pieces of my own art and finance the trips like this. Then I founded the trust and I um, started an online platform where I asked international wildlife artists to contribute to it. So they um, donated prints and then they started donating original pieces. And some of the international artists will be there and they can connect with the children. And well, that's exciting. Yeah, it's, it's very exciting. <laughs> we have this huge international, most famous artist here that made this piece for this exhibition. Carl Brenda's artist. He does only one piece a year and he made it for the Namibian exhibition for the Kaya Moya Trust. And the title is Kaya Moya and I. Is there any more different kinds of arts that we can expect, such as sculptures or anything like that? We have a lot of um, liner cuts, we have etchings, we have sculptures. It's really high quality, so we put a lot of attention to the quality, but you can afford it. And we got some amazing pieces. One of my favorite from El Kaluru, the globe, yes. with the elephants coming together. Who would you say benefits the most from this? Well, I hope the wildlife of Namibia, because we're hoping to touch hearts and change minds. For more information about Kaya Moya or the exhibition, simply head over to their website, that's kayamoya.com. We hope to see you there because this is going to be an experience you won't want to miss.